So in case you're wondering why BNB went down around $50 in the past few hours, it's because some major stuff just went down with the CEO and owner of Binance. So Chang Peng Zhao, who is the majority owner and CEO of Binance, just decided to step down and plead guilty to charges related to money laundering. So apparently there was a lot going on with not only money laundering, but according to Bloomberg and some other sources, it was actually being used that being Binance, to funnel money for different terrorist groups like Hamas. Binance also happens to be by far the biggest crypto exchange on the planet. So you can see the difference between Binance and number two being OKX. Of course, this is from November of last year when this was sourced, but you can see the impact that this could have on just crypto in general and the sentiment in general for not only Binance and BNB, but just for the entire industry. We just had to deal with FTX about a year ago, and now we have this happening just about a year later. So as per the agreement, basically Binance has to pay $4.3 billion to settle criminal charges, and he has to plead guilty, that being Zhao, and he has to also step down as CEO. However, he still gets to maintain majority ownership from what I understand. So in the future, according to Attorney General Merrick B. Garland, Binance must file suspicious activity reports, otherwise known as SARs, as required by law. Binance is required to review past transactions and report suspicious activity to federal authorities. This will help with, with criminal investigations into terrorism, fundraising, and malicious cyber activity. As far as who's gonna succeed Zhao as the next CEO of Binance, he apparently picked Richard Tang, who is already a part of Binance, to become the next CEO. So obviously BNB has been feeling the effects of this, although it seems to be going back up a little bit by about 1% since the day change, but you can see why it had such a dramatic plunge after this news came out. So we'll see what happens with BNB. But according to Binance, after getting a statement from Attorney General Garland, Binance sees $4.3 billion in payment as just a drop in the bucket because of how successful they are and how big of a hold they have on the market and they believe everything will be fine going into the future and users should not be too alarmed by this.